What's up, everyone? We are the Smooth Brain Boys, and we are playing Red Dead Redemption 2 on PS4. I have Hector here beside me. Hector, how are you doing today? I'm doing good, man. How are you doing? Good. Just here enjoying this break. Enjoyed Christmas as well. It's pretty nice. Yeah, man. I'm really excited. We've been wanting this for a while. And I have to say, it's been a long time coming. And I hope, you know, all our friends and our family that are that watch have a good time with us playing Red Dead Redemption 2 one of my favorite games of all time Did Red you know Dead that? is really really good I've yeah. never played Red Dead 1 but um, for those of you that know how, how the series works um, you'll see how what the end result is to be honest with you. I think this is Rockstar Games best game to be honest with you yeah by far dude by far unless, unless you're gonna say it's like the latest Grand Theft Auto game cause it still hasn't died they haven't made another new one in like it's been over 10 years, I'm sure. Well, Red Dead 6, and, like, I don't like how they're teasing the game so much either, dude. Yeah? Because, like, Red Dead 6, they said, like, the director, like, I think one of the producers like, oh, yeah, the director of Red Dead 6 hasn't even been born yet. <laughs> it's like, dude, how old is Grand Theft Auto 5? Quit adding yeah, stuff to Grand Theft Auto 5, just get six wrong. Dude, you want, you want to hear something sad? Okay. What? The composer of, of, of the... the per the composer that made the music for this game died last year. For Red Dead. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that was in my newsfeed, and I thought that was so sad because the music in this game is fantastic. Everything about this game is fantastic. The story, um, the character development, dude. I like these games so much. I named my son after the main character. I heard you say that. Yeah. Um, so that's how much I liked. That's how much this game impacted my life, bro. So, how are you feeling, man? I'm feeling pretty good. So, ongoing with your channel, what kind of stuff do you plan on doing? Well, we're going to be doing Red Dead for one. As soon as we get a capture card, I think we'll, we'll start streaming some stuff for, for Nintendo, for Switch as well. Or just games that are on, on the Switch. You, dude, you know what we got to do? What? We got to we gotta play Smash. Smash? We got to have ourselves a little tourney. We gotta invite. You gotta invite friends who are down to play Smash and have ourselves a little tourney. I think that'd be down. I already know someone that's already willing to play with us. <laughs> yeah. So, what's what's something that you that a game you would like to play aside from, aside from Bring this very here. fantastic Red Dead Redemption Two? Honestly, Thomas floated by Metroid Dread. Yeah. I think that'd be pretty cool because it goes back to, you know, old school, you know. Metroid Castlevania stuff. And Castlevania would be a good series to play as well. I heard those games are hard as fuck, dude. Yeah? Yeah. You know, I'm such a... I'm such a weenie when it comes to a lot of games, dude. I don't know how we're gonna do it, because I'm the kind of person that just loses and loses and loses out of nowhere I win. Trying to open the drink enough to want. Yeah? What do you think? We got some Modelo in the house today. Shout out to Modelo. <laughs> Yeah, right. Dude, so shout out to Modell and shout out to Tony Solo, dude. Tony is no longer drinking. Dude, really? Yeah, dude. Tony had that seizure. Oh, yeah, dude. You shouldn't be saying that. No, Tony's cool. I'm sure Tony would be cool with me saying that. Because he posted on his social media. So, yeah, dude. So Tony hasn't drank, and I hope, you know, he says he's going to come back and he's going to start exercising, and I really hope he sticks to it. I'm also trying to get into the gym. What the hell is it? Oh, the dogs. Is the dogs. Oh yeah, yeah dude. Fine. Shout out to the shout out to the dogs in the back, the little ladies. <laughs> shout out to Phoebe. She. What kind of breed is Phoebe? She's a Phoebe's like a okay. lab. She's a chocolate lab, I think. And then what's this new dog? She's Aussie dude. And her name is Piper. Piper, dude. What an adorable little thing. That thing is so cute. I, it makes me miss when my dog was a puppy. Barbosa. Shout out to Barbosa. Shout out to Barbosa. Dude, can I just say something? The first time I played this game, um, yeah, I believe it was during the. I think it was during the winter. So whenever I saw the scene when it was cold as fuck, I could relate to it. Cause I think también cayó nieve. I remember playing this game. I remember playing this game as at the beginning of quarantine. We've been through worse than this. Yeah, Jim, we're playing this game at the beginning of quarantine. Um, I was really just collecting the garments. You know me. Yeah. I think that's what it takes up a lot of people's time is collecting all the stuff for your camp. 
and for Arthur as well. All the outfits and stuff like that too. Yeah. yeah. I also liked doing the... You know something I never really got into was the fishing aspect of the game. Fishing aspect? Yeah. I couldn't fish. Did you uh, like fishing? I did, somewhat. The hunting aspect. Yeah, so, I mean, absolutely. I think that's one of my favorite things of the game. I'm not down to hunt in real life, but in this game, I'm down to <laughs> shoot a bear and skin it. Three stars and all. Um, can you, so for those of for those of you out there that don't know me and Danny are brothers. I'm the I'm actually I'm the oldest, and uh, this is actually something that we've been wanting to do for a while. Yeah, we've been telling a lot of our friends, and I can't wait to get more friends on here. They're pretty cool, man. I have no idea who wants me on here. You know what? I gotta get just chucking and jiving with us. Yeah, dude. You doing we, stupid we, shit. You know what else we gotta do? What? We gotta. We also gotta uh, do the the podcast too, dude. Podcast? Yeah. I feel like that would be a lot easier to do than recording the game. Play, yeah. Yeah. We, I'll explain to you. You know, after we get done. But. Yeah. I mean, the podcast I think would be really interesting too. Except if we get some wacky ass people on there, man. Yeah, dude. You know what I was think- You know what I was, uh, You know what I realized yesterday? What? That I don't like sweets as much as I used to. Really? Yeah. Because we were eating ice cream at your house yesterday, and I just I ate it mainly because that's just what everybody wanted to do, and I was kind of hungry either way. But I I used to remember love eating ice cream. I could eat three cones, dude. Three of those dipped cones. Yeah, the drumsticks. Mm-hmm. I could eat three of those, and yesterday I just ate one. Even then, I was just like, "Oh, dude, how, how many Big Macs did you can eat in one sitting?" Dude? Uh, Big Macs, dude. To be honest, I don't really eat Big Macs. I'll eat one. You know, what I'll eat a lot of McDoubles. McDoubles. No, no, McChickens. Those are the little chicken patty ones. Yeah. How many of those do you think you can eat? Six. Six. Yeah. Six. That's yeah. a that's a pretty bold statement. Six McDoubles. You I mean, told me I can eat half of the lasagna we had yesterday. Dude, dude, you, you know what? My wife and I were talking about that today. She's like, <laughs> she's like, you and S O are S O's our other youngest brother. He's like, yeah. you and S O are assholes making fun of Donnie for eating half a lasagna, even though you and S O, um, uh, even though you and S O both ate breakfast. You guys both, we still went to my uh, in-laws house, yeah. and we still ate soup, and we still ate carne asada like you did, ah, and then we still went to your ha- we still went to your house and had the ice cream, and then uh, we still went to uh, my in-laws house, and uh, no, we still went to we still went to my house and we had the lasagna. Yeah. And dude, I had a pretty big piece of lasagna, even if even though you had five portions of it. Dude, I don't know, man. Like, why you half of the, I hate ha- half of that family size thing because I didn't eat it wasn't a family size it was a party size (laughs) (laughs) well I ate half of it because I didn't eat anything all day and I I was anticipating the lasagna I'm sorry and then then you were like oh it's in the freezer there he is I sold that dude Micah for those of you that don't know this game Micah's a butt I'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave it at that I agree dude um I will say I was today I ate pizza and I never eat pizza, dude. Yeah, dude. Dude, I never eat pizza. You know what? You know what kind of pizza I got today? What? Uh, I, you know what? I'm gonna say this unpopular opinion. My, my, I think one of the best pizzas out there. Unsung hero, ready for this? Buffalo chicken with red onions on top. So good, dude. I don't know, dude. I'm a pretty big advocate for buffalo sauce in general. So really, yeah. I don't like buffalo sauce. Like I I'm, love buffalo sauce. Man. I don't do buffalo sauce on wings. I don't do buffalo sauce on hardly anything. But for some reason, the way buffalo sauce, the cheese, and the chicken, I don't know why. And I like it on thin crust pizza. Thin crust. I like thin, thin crust. Like crispy. Hell, uh, dude. <laughs> what's wrong? <laughs> That's. <weird. laughs> what's wrong with? What's wrong with thin crust pizza, bro? Uh, Can you? Pre- I mean, I like it, dude. I have a bad experience with thin crust pizza, dude. This is the thing. Like one time, I forgot. I don't know how old I was, but I was eating it because you know when you're a kid, you just gobble shit down, and just a, a shard of it just like scraped the top of my the roof of my mouth, uh, and I felt like flesh hanging off, and I was oh like, oh my was like, gosh, oh, bro, that's yeah. so sad. So like, I went to the bathroom, like I I like literally ripped out this piece, piece of, of flesh. flesh. Yeah, oh my god, I threw god. the sink, and I was uh, like. Oh, it's horrible. Like it scabbed over later. Yeah, of course. After that, I, I whenever I eat thin crust pizza, I just I I make sure I chew that shit properly. You ready for this? 
What? Fuck pineapple pizza. You're an asshole, dude. Dude, yeah. I hate pineapple pizza so much. I hate it so, so much. I don't know. I don't even. I don't even know why, dude. I think because I remember there was a point in time when I was a kid I liked pineapple pizza. And then I don't, know, tramado, what? I don't know, dude. I must have just had like a bad piece, or it must have, I must have gotten sick from it once. And ever since then, I just don't want to do it anymore. You know what? I used to rep out the uh, pineapple and ham pizza when I was like the ten Hawaiian. years old. Yeah, that used to be my, one of my favorite pizzas when I was ten. And from like, I don't know, dude. It must have been like when I got into high school. It just my I just stopped liking it. Or you know what happened one time? I must have gone like. I think one time I got like a piece of pineapple that was still cold. Like the pizza was, I mean, it was kind of cold. And I and that kind of just. I don't know. I like I like uh, I like cold pizza. Uh, I'm an advocate for cold pizza, not frozen pizza. Dude. No, 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 no. I know that uh, leftover on the counter shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. hate that, dude. Why? Dude, why? I just don't. I like my food to be hot. Dude, I like my food to be hot and steaming and possibly bubbling. Um, I think that one of my favorite foods. Oh shit! <laughs> no! Oh! What happened? You fell down, dude. Dude, I was looking at Phoebe because she's messing with the uh, Piper. In the, uh, <laughs> oh my I just saw God, a freaking dude. front flip, dude. That's I didn't know that could even happen. Ah, oh, God. <laughs> it's all, Gosh, you learned something new whenever you play Red Dead, dude. Yeah, dude. Jeez. He found a shortcut. So it's all good. <laughs> I cut out a lot of talking. <laughs> I just like dig. They're like mid dialogue. If I was any, if it, if I was any better, I could intentionally say I was doing a speed run. Hell. And I'm like, in order to get the quickest time, you have to. Kill your horse oh right gosh, here, right now. This part always makes me sad. I don't know why. Oh, this part right here? He's just like in a blizzard, I guess you could say. Yeah. He, your Apologize. your horse isn't a rock climber, dude. No. Okay. Follow Dutch, dude. These horses are in the way, though. Dude, are you stuck? Okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but sometimes when I'm at work, I always think of myself doing just this, just that. Skip, skip to your loot. I think. <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, what's supposed to be going on here? I'm oh, going to the shed. You gotta, you gotta go to the shed to take cover. Oh in yeah. There, yeah. Yeah, I remember this part. I have to go in here. Excuse me. Dude, those those Pepsis are really doing a number on you, huh? <laughs> All right, man. We're hitting that 13-minute mark, so I think we're going to close off right here. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure you like and subscribe. You got to think of sector. Dude, shout out to Tummy. Tummy, we hope that you know that we think you're awesome and sucks you're in quarantine. All right. Bye, guys. See you later. Oh,